What's going on guys? Today I am here with a Destiny 2 video talking about the mystery behind the Leviathan Raid. Now since the Destiny 2 trophies for PS4 have been revealed, we now know the name of the first raid in Bungie's upcoming game Destiny 2. The raid is called the Leviathan. Now it's important to state that the details I'm going to mention are possible spoilers for Destiny 2's raid, but also it is not factual. It's all speculation, although for the most part it makes a lot of sense. It's still speculative information, not confirmed by Bungie though. Okay, so basically the community over the past few days have been trying to piece together what in my opinion are blatant hints by Bungie on the raid within Destiny 2. So let's get into it. Okay, so at the Destiny 2 reveal a few months back, Luke Smith was representing the team talking about Destiny 2. Now it isn't what he was saying here that's interesting, but it's what he was wearing. Seeing on screen now, you can see him wearing this hoodie with what seems to be a random logo on it, and for the most part was a random logo up until recent. So a few days back, the trophies for Destiny 2 on PS4 were released on the internet. A few stood out as being seriously interesting, but for today's video, there are only a couple I need to speak about, and the first one is this one right here. So the trophy is called Belly of the Beast. Mission, complete the Leviathan Raid. So the raid is confirmed to be the Leviathan Raid. So what is Leviathan? Let's find out. So upon researching for about an hour, the word Leviathan originally was used to describe enormous sea monsters that literally swallow all in their path. Nowadays the word is used on a more regular basis describing many many things. In fact a quick search of Leviathan on Google Images brings up the following pictures of many giant flying sea creatures. Now me being a massive Marvel fan, the word Leviathan jumps straight at me as being one of those giant city eating intergalactic beasts and warships seen in the movie in the Avengers. So Leviathan can be used to describe many things, but mainly used within describing something enormous, whether that by sea or air. Okay, so a closer look at the Leviathan Raid Destiny 2 trophy. In the top left corner we see the very same logo Luke Smith had on his hoodie during that Destiny 2 reveal event but this one's just upside down. So what is the logo? Well, during the beta of Destiny 2, concept images were released regarding Destiny 2, this being one of them. This image portrays what looks to be like a planet swallowing craft or creature. It is literally sucking that planet in. So where does this come in, you're thinking? Well, besides the fact it's absolutely enormous and it seems to be swallowing all in its path, this could easily be described as a Leviathan, but there's more. Look at the shape of that mouth with that glowing light sitting above. It's actually the same shape of that very logo Luke Smith wore on that hoodie, as well as what's seen on the Leviathan Raid trophy icon. Bungie also released another concept image of this, but we can clearly see this time a ship is flying down towards this thing. So let's zoom in a little here. On top of this enormous ship-like structure, we see what looks to be buildings. Now going by the size of this thing and the planet it's basically eating, these buildings could easily hold a civilization for sure, with what looks to be its very own floating star above. So the clues are rather interesting, but it doesn't end there. Thanks to the eager eyes of the guys over on Reddit, check this out. On the left of the Leviathan-like creature, we see some pretty bright shining stars. So let's pair them together and see what we get. And in actual fact, we get the constellation known as Cetus. A quick Google search for the meaning behind the word and we get the following. Cetus is a constellation. Its name refers to Cetus, a sea monster in Greek mythology. I mean it makes sense that this thing right here is Leviathan. The name of the trophy coincides with us taking on whoever is behind this raid within this space beast. Another image seen on screen now showcases Guardians about to encounter something of great structure. Also notice the rocks orbiting in. Could this be the way into the belly of the beast where we take on this raid? I'm guessing it might be. Now thinking about this, you would instantly think this raid would be against Gaul and his Red Legion, but in fact that might not be the case at all. Check this out, Luke Smith at the very same Destiny 2 reveal event changed hoodies and was also seen wearing this one right here. Notice the three symbols on this hoodie. At the time we were none the wiser, but again after seeing those PS4 Destiny 2 trophies, we kind of get a clue as to what this means. Check out this trophy on screen now. Least ye be judged. Encounter an emissary from beyond. We can also see this rocks the very same three logos. But even more interesting are the Roman numerals. We see nine, as in agents of the nine. 
So what does this mean you are wondering? Well this is where we dive deep into Destiny's lore. If you guys ain't familiar with Legends and Mysteries, the Ghost Fragment Legends 2 Grimoire card, it speaks of the Nine. Interestingly, it states the following. The Nine are ancient Leviathan intelligences from the seas of Europa or the hydrocarbon pits of Titan. So the Nine are also tied in with Leviathan 2. Also the planet within Destiny 2, Titan with its 90% oceans, makes you seriously think. But hey, the mysteries behind all this is what keeps us interested for sure. And on that note guys, I'm going to end the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Tell me down below what you think about what I've mentioned in the video today. Again, thanks for stopping by and if you made it to the end, you are a legend. I will hopefully see you guys on that next one.